Hi everyone and welcome back. In the previous videos we have explained the future simple with both will and going to. In today's video I'm gonna start with future continuous. So let's start with the form. In the affirmative we have subject plus will plus be plus verb and ing. As I have mentioned before, whenever you see the continuous you have to add ing to the verb. So here subject plus will be plus verb and ing. In the negative we have subject plus will plus not plus be plus verb and ing so only just attach not to the auxiliary verb and in the question we just swap the will the auxiliary verb to make it as a, at the, the beginning and just add it with the subject plus be plus verb and ing this is the form of future continuous what about the usage when do we have to use the future continuous so we have only two situations the first thing actions in a progress at a specific time in the future so actions that ongoing at a specific time in the future so in the future this action will be ongoing will be continuous another case here actions that will happen as a matter of course so which means like uh, actions will happen in the future as a consequence like uh, so what I mean by matter of course I mean like for example I have called my friend and he said I am walking to the home now so this means that he will be arriving soon so I can say he will be arriving soon since he is walking now right now to the home so of course he will be arriving soon a matter of course so those two cases now you can see the examples the three first three examples about actions in progress at a specific time in the future like for example he will be working at 8 p.m. so he is not working now but in the future at a specific time in the future at 8 p.m. he will be working he will be continuous working ongoing working in the future they will be traveling to Paris next week so they are not traveling to Paris now ongoing but in the future they will be traveling to Paris I'll be sleeping at that time so at that time in the future I'm not sleeping now but for example I, I asked my friend to come at 1 a.m. tomorrow he said I will be sleeping at that time another case is here actions that will happen as a matter of course like for example she will be arriving soon as I have said before like for example I have called my sister and she said I am on the taxi now which means she will be arriving soon as a matter of course and we can say we will be meeting the clients later maybe we have we should we must meet the clients so I, sh I say we will be meeting the clients later because we have to meet the clients. The final example here, we will be presenting at the conference. So we have already prepared everything about the uh, presentation, the PowerPoint and everything. And I say we'll, we will be presenting at the conference. So in the future, we will be presenting at the conference conference because it's a matter of course we already have a conference so we have to present in this conference the negative form like for example he will be working at 8 p.m. I can say he will not be working and at 8 p.m. they will not be traveling to Paris next week I will not be sleeping at that time the question for example we have he will be working at 8 p.m. will he be working at 8 p.m. So just add the auxiliary verb, the will, before the subject he. And the be still after subject. Like, will he be working? Will they be traveling to Paris next week? Will I be sleeping at that time? That's everything about the future continuous.